As COVID-19 cases are again creeping up across the RGV, science has not confirmed how long those who have already survived the virus may be immune. CBS 4's Rocio Villalobos spoke with a health authority over the likelihood of getting reinfected and what precautions people should continue to take. We do have science that says yes, it's mutated, and yes, you can get reinfected. Hidalgo County Health Authority Dr. Yvonne Melendez says people who have recovered from COVID-19 should not let their guard down and that the widespread belief of immunity lasting for three months has not been proven. It's purely an assumption that most people have protection for some period of time. The cousins of this coronavirus, one to three years. This one, we don't know. It's novel. It could be one to three months. There have been a handful of cases of reinfection across the globe. These cases were actually proven by analyzing the viruses the first time and the second time, and they both demonstrated that indeed there were two different strains of the virus, that the virus had mutated. He says here in McAllen, several people have tested positive months after receiving two negative tests. But without a genome analysis, it cannot be determined whether they were actually reinfected. When you get symptoms again, you know, you can't taste, you can't smell, you have the body aches, you have fever, absolutely get retested. But that's not going to tell you whether it's a new virus or an old virus. With reinfection so far proving rare, Dr. Melinda says people should be optimistic, but remain careful. You should still use the same recommendations of social distancing, wearing the face mask, hygiene, etc. Dr. Melinda says he is hopeful for a vaccine to be distributed by Christmas and that the infrastructure is already in place. But what remains to be decided is how to get it out and who gets it first. Working for you in Hidalgo County, Rocio Villalobos.